Local 4 News starts now with a breaking news alert. That breaking news from Detroit's east side where a two-year-old is in the hospital after a dog ran into her home and attacked her. And that tops our news this Monday afternoon. That child was attacked earlier this afternoon on the 10,000 block of Weyburn, which is near Whittier Avenue and I-94. Let's bring in Jason Colthorpe. He is live from the scene. Jason, this is just a horrific story. I mean, it's an understatement, Karen. Just a freakishly heartbreaking accident here today and an attack on a little girl. It happened at this house behind me that you see here on the corner. And out front, you can clearly see a child stroller there. And this was a two-year-old girl who was inside her own home when this happened. She was attacked. Her father then shot and killed the dog. Take a look at some video we have from earlier when this was a much more active scene. Uh, this happened a little bit before 11 o'clock. This morning, uh, police say this was a stray dog, and I talked to some neighbors out here who had seen this dog. There's a little discrepancy about what the what the breed was, but uh, they said they'd seen it. It hadn't been aggressive to them, but then suddenly today uh, it attacked when someone opened the door. Here's what police had to say about how it happened. One of the residents opened up the front door and a huge pit bull just ran in and began charging at a female two year old and began attacking that female um, baby. Like any father, you know, he was looking at to protect his child, period. Yeah, and as we say, several shots fired. The dog was killed. Uh, the little girl was actually grazed in her arm. She was rushed to the hospital where she is critical and at last check was undergoing surgery. She has severe bite marks to her head as well. We're going to talk more about that at five and also talk more about what kind of dog this was. There was, uh, like we said, there were some earlier reports. It was a different breed. We'll talk about that when we see you at five o'clock. Karen.